so you want to start using the new feature Siri Shortcuts on your iPhone, iPad or iPod Touch. It's easy and this is how to do it. First off, you need to have iOS 12 on your device. Make sure to update if you haven't. I have a video explaining how to update step by step and what to do if it doesn't work as it should. When you have iOS 12, we need to download the app Shortcuts from App Store. If you need help on how to download apps, I have a video on that too. When the app is downloaded, we open the app. We want to create our first shortcut, so tap Create Shortcut. First, tap this button. Here we can add a name. I'll name this shortcut Bedtime. Choose an icon. Add a spoken phrase, bedtime, so you can use the shortcut with Siri. Let's add the content of the shortcut. I'll choose do not disturb. We get different options depending on what app or feature we choose. We can still add more content. What about listening to some music? And let's add one more. Maybe we always want to keep an eye on this stock. And then tap done. And let's try it out. Bedtime. The music starts and I see the stock we chose. Here we can see that Do Not Disturb is activated too. And that is the basics of Siri Shortcuts. More third-party apps will probably support Siri Shortcuts soon, and the possibilities will be pretty much endless. The videos I mentioned is linked in the description along with Apple's own guide about shortcuts. Don't forget to like this video if it was helpful and subscribe to the channel. Lastly, go and follow me on Instagram, Simon Says Apple. Thank you for watching.